Your breaking news tonight. Police arrest a suspected serial killer wanted for gunning down four victims in four days, including three homeless people and a man who was killed in a follow home. All right. Um, four. And, and oh, he did that, dude. We did the follow home of the Asian guy the other day, the, the Asian tech guy um, that got killed. Did you remember that from the other day? The Asian, I remember the know. Asian guy in the Porsche. Yeah, the car, he so. got, he got, yeah, the Porsche. He got, he got oh, followed yeah. home. So they found the guy. I don't remember they, they, all, they all looked at ten. Yeah, they're saying that guy killed three other people. Um, what do you uh, remember? We were trying to figure out the race, but they wouldn't give it to us. What do you guys think? I've seen gliders mm -hmm. murder homeless people before, so it could be a glider. Yeah, it could okay. be. Like a Jeffrey. I'm, I'm gonna go with always on some though. The carjacking though, the follow home carjacking is just a red flag. For, I don't see that out of Gladys. In the killing of homeless people, they said, hold on. Let me play the game. breaking news tonight. Police arrest a suspected serial killer wanted for gunning down four victims in four days, including three homeless people and a man who was three homeless people, like That's a that's a sun crime. Just shooting homeless people. That's a that's a sun crime. I'm gonna go with some man. Yep. Killed in a fall. Yeah, I mean, and, and I'm talking about some men from all walks of life, like lawyers. We had a lawyer that killed mm -hmm. a bunch of homeless people, in Miami, a couple of years ago. Real estate agent. Yeah, real estate agent. Yeah, yeah. Remember him? Yeah. It's, it's killing homeless people is a sun crime, and carjacking is a sun crime. So I'm, I'm going to say son. Mm -hmm. All a home robbery in San Dimas. Yeah, let's go right to Omar Lewis. He is live at LAPD headquarters in downtown L.A. where the chief, Michael Moore, and the mayor, Karen Bass, both announced that arrest. Omar? Yeah, that's right, Rick and Kareen. LAPD Chief Michael Moore says that detectives were able to use surveillance video and forensic testing to connect all of these cases. They now arrested that suspect and have the murder weapon that they believed was used in all four of these cases here. We can take you to video and show you this suspect, 33-year-old Jared Joseph Powell of Los Damn glider. <laughs> Jared Powell. Remember yesterday we were trying to figure out from his name um, who, you know what I'm saying, who it was? Um, well, I don't know if you guys want to show that day, but I was trying to, we were trying to figure out who, um, who, who did that. You know what I'm saying? Like who was the, who was the culprit? Um, um, and we, we couldn't figure it out. And um, so I Googled the name Jared Powell, right? I Googled the name Jared Powell to try to see if we could get him his picture, right? Yesterday. Well, this was two days ago. And it was the it was the damnedest thing because when I Googled Jared Powell, I didn't do this on the show, I did this like on my own time. This guy comes up, Gerald Powell from New York, and he was arrested for an attack on an Asian man in New York City. But this is not the wow. Jared Powell. Right. This is another like, guy from New York. <laughs> that's how you know that the numbers are way high. If you can find that coincidence <laughs> out there, the numbers are out of control. I was yeah. like, I was like, yo, because at first I was like, oh, okay, it was a black guy. Then I looked at the story. That's where you got re headlined. It said, ex con Jared Powell arrested for attack on Asian man in NYC. And that was LA. That He killed that Asian guy in LA. This this one, the new, this, this Jared Powell that we're doing the story on now. <laughs> so it's like, wow. <laughs> Unbelievable. It's le it leaves you speechless. You know what I'm saying? Uh, freaking serial killer, pretty much. Wow. What's the odds of two Jared Powell, two dudes named Jared Powell in different cities? 
attacking Asian guys. Both of them are black. That's insane, man. Here, we can take you to video and show you this suspect, 33-year-old Jared Joseph Powell of Los Angeles. He's allegedly the gunman responsible of the murders of three homeless men across L.A. from November 26th to the 29th. He's also the prime suspect in that follow-home murder of Nicholas Simbolon, who was shot and killed in the garage of his San Dimas home on Tuesday night. The L.A. County Sheriff's Department made an arrest in that case after a vehicle seen in surveillance video following Simbolon home from an EV charging station was placed into a law enforcement database. Powell was arrested in a traffic stop by Beverly Hills Police on Thursday, and a weapon was also recovered in a news conference today. The LAPD says their detective work helped them make the connection that the suspect accused of shooting and killing the three unhoused people in LA was the same person arrested in the San Dimas case. And the result of their work has positively identified the handgun recovered from Mr. Powell's car as being the murder weapon of our three homicides. Additionally, our investigation has documented Mr. Powell's vehicle as being at the murder scene of all three homicides. And Mr. Powell's physical appearance is consistent with the imagery recovered to this point. We have not yet established a motive of Mr. Powell in these three murders. The string of killings of homeless people happened as they slept alone. It all started around 3 a.m. Sunday in an alley. The second happened the next day shortly before 5 a.m. And a third homeless person was killed Wednesday around 2.30 a.m. Los Angeles Mayor Karen Bass thanked law enforcement officials for their quick detective work and prayed. The fucking mayor of L.A. is a fucking sister now? Shit. Hey, they had some diversity as the chief, though. They had a glider, man. Yeah. Salute to them, man. Wow. You don't think she's doing a good job? Nah, I don't 